The Serber family has been farmers for over 200 years, seven generations worth, so our roots run deep in agriculture. Pig farming was a good fit for our family. We worked together, we laughed together, and it certainly has changed the conversation around our supper table. I'm Connie Serber, and I live in Clinton County, Ohio. This is a finishing barn, and by that I mean that we'll receive the baby pigs and we'll feed them and take care of them for about six months of their life until they get to be 260 to 275 pounds. We're extremely biosecure in that we shower in, we shower out, any tools or equipment that goes in gets wiped down with a disinfectant. Any uh, vehicle that comes to our barn is washed, dried, and disinfected before it comes in, and that's the way we can control the traffic. We don't want our animals to, to get any diseases, so this is a way to have our healthy animals because they go on to be mamas somewhere. We've had them go all over the United States, even to Mexico. This is what we do every day. We'll come in in the morning, first thing, get the pigs up. Get up, girls, let's go. Get up, we want to see everybody. Get up, girls, let's go. Let's go, get up, girls. Then we'll get in the pens and walk the pens to make sure everybody doesn't have any injuries or everybody is, is where they should be. We raise the pigs inside the barns these days because if you raise them inside the barn, we've taken away all their stresses of Ohio weather outside. If they're outside, they'll have to adjust to the heat or the cold. And when we bring them inside the barns, we've taken away all their stresses so they can concentrate on just being healthy, happy pigs that can grow. Well, I think what's special about our family raising pigs is some people get up and go to work and that's their job. This is not our job, this is our life. We live it every single day and we love our life. Cleanliness is important to the consumer because it assures you have safe, affordable food. As a mother and as a grandma, I want to make sure and put safe food on our table. And I think it's very important that other mothers know that when they provide pork for their family, that it's very safe. I would not provide pork for other families that I wouldn't feed my own family.